Hi, this is Linda. You're watching Video Wave, and we are talking to Ken and Danielle, alias Professor and Marianne. And they're out touring, supporting their new album, CD, Lead Us Not Into Penn Station. Great name. So, so tell me, you guys, your folk band, vocal, guitar. Uh, tell me about your new record, writing techniques, what, what you think about the new record as opposed to your last. Come Whoever on. wants to go. The new record, it's, it's, it's stimulating, fascinating. Profound? Profound. <laughs> Profound, uh, video wave viewers. Um, yes. That's all we can say about it, really. I guess you got to listen to it. So, um, now, I forgot the title of the, the theme to the, what was the play titled one? The play titled one? Claire. Claire. Right. Oh, the theme from Claire the Musical. Now, that's different. Now, is that really a full-length musical, or is that... No, it's a, it's imaginary made musical. It made it up totally. But maybe one day it'll be a full length musical. <laughs> Are you going to expand on the theme, maybe? Um, I, if I knew what the theme was, then expanding on it would, would work. If I have no idea what it's, it's just just a little little ditty. So so this is your second record. Yes. How long? Right off the Claire thing, huh? Let's move on. <laughs> Forget that. That died. I wanted to know if that was a musical. <laughs> it's not a musical. Not a... Let's move on. <laughs> okay. So, so how long have you been playing together? Uh, how long have you been playing together? Five years? Four years. Four years. But it's your second CD. You've been touring pretty consistently. Yes. I guess if you want to call them tours, we go, uh, you know, we play here next door. Oh, I noticed, <laughs> I noticed on your CD, it said thanks to, I, ho I hope the mic's close right. enough. I'm like, this is a stretch. Okay. I noticed it said thanks to Ludlow Street Cafe. Was right. that uh, where you first started playing a lot in the area or no no they're one of the only places that said play here all the time every oh. week oh so, so they're nice yes they're nice really nice and they they treat us well so we figured we'd thank them so okay you you are the lyric writer do you you write all the lyrics well daniel writes some lyrics oh you do you also do yeah sometimes some, so how how do you split it up? One of you comes in to the studio or rehearsal space with the lyric and His the other bedroom. Ah, this is getting interesting. <laughs> the red light, we turn on the red light and you know, that's it. Lyrics oh, that's like fly. that police song that I don't yeah. like. All right, never mind. <laughs> you know that song, Roxanne? Yes, you don't like Roxanne? It's like I'm an institution. Sorry. I, yeah, well, I'm right. sorry. That's okay. Yeah, yeah. I like music that no one else likes, so okay. it's okay. <laughs> All right. So um, let's what talk was about. Question? Was there a question? What okay. was the question? I don't think there were. All right. Um, lyrics writing. Lyrics. Up. Yeah. All right. I don't know. It just it just comes Good out. Memory. Thanks for helping. You don't have you don't have a particular. We don't have a way of. Died in the wool method. No, then. he no. writes a lot of music a lot, constantly. So. Ah, just do it. So you've got the next CD all ready to go. We do. Just need, uh, you know, the money to make it. Well, with this grand exposure, I am sure. Oh, yes. <laughs> I'm sure also. So, well, let's, let's see a little bit of what we're discussing. And uh, let, let's go to a uh, live action video right now. We're back again with the professor and Marianne, Ken and Danielle. So tell me, did you ever feel like uh, indulging in role reversal on stage? Yeah, I wanted to. We have to. done that. Do you ever dress in costume? We've done, we've done, I've been her and she's been me. I wore a dress and she uh, wore a beard. How about the, the pigtails? No pigtails. No. no? no. But that's part of the costume. No, we were simulating each other. No, oh, okay, okay. No, not, not actual anything, anything to do with any television show. So you were, you were a professor. Yes, I was. But Danielle, on the other hand, was never Marianne. No, no. I've never been Marianne. Past I life, just, maybe. I lied. <laughs> How'd you come up with the name? Um, we were in a Japanese restaurant, sushi, I guess. Oh, it was the sake yeah, that did yeah, it. Yeah, something did it, but I don't know. There's no, uh, there was no deep thought at all. Just came no. out of my mouth. We used it, and uh, we've been regretting it solidly. Band names <laughs> are the hardest thing, though. Yeah. It's like you can never be serious. No, definitely you, not. Uh, the goofier things are always not. I'm not calling you goofy. No, no, no. Okay. <laughs> you can't. Just remembering past discussions, trying to name other bands. Yeah. 
That's all right. And we just spit out the name and it seemed to, who the hell knows. So can you answer a question for me, you guys? What's the difference between folk and anti-folk? I don't even know what folk is. This is your test question of the day. Anti-folk requires an antenna. Folk, you can just, you can get without the antenna. But you know what I mean. You know what I mean. I like that. You know what I mean, though. It's like yeah, all these I, shows are, are advertised as anti-folk, and I'm like, well, really? I heard the anti-folk thing. I don't know what that yeah. is. That's sort of an, a, a guitar player that's cursing or something. Oh, you mean you have to be swearing and yeah, yeah. Oh, okay. I think that's where the anti comes in. But I've seen acts that were considered anti-folk. Okay. So. So that just means you have to have a bit of a. You have a bit of a. If you're angry. But not politically angry, because that would be folk. Or, just or, generally angry. Just generally angry. Yeah. Maybe you can work on that for your next no, record. No, I, I think we this can is... do that. <laughs> Help us. We're pretty pissed off, so it'll work out. We'll be anti-folk one day. I don't right. Know. So that's I don't know what assuming folk is. you get led into Penn Station, and then you're pretty pissed off. Right. Then we'll make the uh, anti-folk. It's a natural progression. <laughs> I don't know. You got us. You got us on tape. <laughs> you got our images. It'll happen. It'll happen. You've been watching Video Wave, Professor Marianne. Professor Marianne. Hi. Different moods. And Linda. Tune in again. Go. My boss is yelling at me. It's Alma. We're still up on the roof. I heard it was going to rain, so I put on my handy dandy raincoat. Anyway, upcoming shows, great people. We have Phoebe Legere, Jonathan Richman, and Frontline Assembly. Now, we have a new concept here that we're working out with the producers, all of the many producers we have of this great show. We are going to read your letters on the air. So we're looking for, for your long distance dedications. We're looking for your, your hopes, your dreams, any comments, anything you want to see. We're going to start coming up with some new creative things so please I love to get mail I really do so please write me write to me Alma A-L-M-A see on the screen A-L-M-A I'm not sure where it is exactly but to Video Wave care of Trans Ocean 711 12th Avenue New York New York 10019 it's Alma see you later I'll talk to you soon please write your letters I love mail that please address the address Trans OSHA Video Wave Care of Trans OSHA 7-Eleven 12th Avenue New York New York 10019 Alma ALMA like Alma Mater See ya bye